lecture, I am going to discuss about intersect function in Power BI DAX. So here the intersect function in Power BI that return only common field or common records between two tables. So here I am going to use file one table and here you can see this all records and inside file two 30 cells UK 40 operation boost. And if I go on this, then you can see here 30 cell UK 40 operation booster. So now let's uh, use here intersect. So for this one, going to create new table and this place going to write here intersect function. So here intersect, then you can see this place. This is the hair left table and right table table you need to write there. I return rows of the left side table which appear in the right side table. This is the definition there. So left table going to use file 1 and right table going to use file 2. Press enter then you can see left table records. So 13 and this all and next here this all. So left table is here file 2 this or displaying all and matching go one with uh, here 40 it's also displaying this place the next uh, here on this table you can see there is all duplicate so we can here use distinct function to load only unique record so if you don't want then you can remove the duplicate by using distinct or here function so it's too simple there intersect function if I try one more or table so let's uh, use here employees then you can see there is the problems unexpected parameter that means intersect only accept two parameter not more than two and there is also a problem with one parameter you can't give one parameter this place you need to give the two parameter and uh, now another testing I'm going to do so here employees so employees table so field file has uh, or three columns and employees has uh, this more than three columns okay so now if I place enter this place so here or this working uh, or here you can see intersects must have same number of columns so there is the constant there so both table must have same number of columns then you can do the intersecting so if columns are varied or columns are different then you cannot do the intersect in the power bi desktop okay so this is how we can do the intersect on power bi so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you